Hey y'all, welcome to another Meaty Monday on Uncle Bub's Bell Buckle Beer Reviews. I know it's not Uncle Bub's Bell Buckle Mead Reviews, it's Beer Reviews, but I've done some meads here in the past on Monday, and I found a couple more while I was in Murfreesboro uh, this past week. Now, on the can itself, it does not call it a mead. It does not say this is mead. Um, what this says is a lightly carbonated wine cocktail with peach. That's what it says, but when you go to the ingredients, the ingredients are water, honey, peach concentrate, ginger, and potassium, some kind of word for freshness. So it's brewed with honey, not grain. So I consider it a mead. All right, so today is uh, on a meaty Monday, we have a Meridian Hive Peach. It's what we're doing today. Now this is only a 5% alcohol by volume. Um, I think all of the other meads I've had have been above 5. I think the lowest was like a 5.9 that I got from the Growing Fail Meadery. Anyway, uh, we're going to try this peach mead from Meridian Hive today on a meaty Monday. Let's see what we got. Well, it's got a little bit of suds in it. Now they'll dissipate really quick. Which they are. They're, they're gone. Just like that. But man, look at that. That is beautiful. You can see the color of that right there? Beautiful gold color. It has just a very, very mild peachy aroma coming off of it. Um, well, shoot. I don't have my stand here. Here's my stand. So you can see what we got here. Meridian Hive Peach. All right, so this Meridian Hive Peach at a 5% ABV, a uh, mead that's not called mead, <laughs> is for all American workers. Hey, I love and appreciate y'all. Thank you so much for all the work that you do to provide for yourself and your family and pull your own weight and support our economy. Thank you. Cheers, brothers and sisters. Wow, that's freaking delicious. Um, it it's kind of hard to describe. It, it's I don't know y'all probably can't see it, but it's still got little bitty bubbles floating up in there, and of course the head dissipated immediately. But it's still got carbonation in the body of this thing, and it's delicious. It I don't I'm not getting a real strong peach flavor out of it, but I am getting the peach, and. Uh, it, it, and just a hint of honey as well. This is good. Mmm. Mmm. Man, that's just got the best. And and you could drink this with anything you want to eat. I mean, it's almost like a it's almost just like a sparkling cider. You can't tell it's got any alcohol in it at all. It's delicious. Um so yeah, the the thing about the Meridian Hive, now I saw I saw them advertise on Facebook, and man, they were like really, really expensive. Um, and I wanted to try them, but they were just way too pricey uh, uh, for my taste. I just couldn't justify doing it. However, um, <laughs> that being said, if you can buy it by the single, it's always better. So I got this one and another one that I'm going to be reviewing next Monday, but I give $4 for the can. It's three ninety nine for his can and, and that can as well. So I mean they're very expensive brews. But when you can try one, I, I'll go four dollars before I'll go twenty four dollars for a six pack. You know what I'm saying? This is good though. This is really good. Not that I would go spend twenty four dollars for a six pack of it. It's not that good, especially with a five percent alcohol by volume. But to try is worth it to me. It's this is really good brew. So there, anyway, there you go. That is a meaty Monday for this week. I'll be back tomorrow. I'm going to do a trash beer Tuesday tomorrow. i got a trash beer I'm going to do for you, so y'all stay tuned for that. I love and appreciate y'all. Y'all stay tuned. Take care. Cheers.